fight given the veteran talent on both sides. Yeah, tremendously high IQs from both teams. So expect a clean game. And some of these players have been through it all in this league. And now the Lakers starting group. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. Austin Reeves out there with Jane. And it's Hachimura in at the small forward position. Now here's Lillard following the miss by Anthony Davis. James against Lillard. Shot clock at six. Here's James. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Kevin Doc Rivers gave me a few minutes to catch up with him. He told me, now that team goes as Anthony Davis goes. When AD is feeling good and he's in rhythm, everything clicks. Coach said we'll need a team effort at both ends. Our communication has to be excellent, and even then, we're not going to completely stop it. Guys? Thank you, David. Miller, the 15-footer, good. Talk about a guy who can beat you consistently from all three levels. That's Damian Lillard. Pass to Hachimura. Back to Reeves. Trent against Hachimura. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Definitely saved a layup with that foul. And He'll make him earn them from the line, and that's what you want to see. The Bucs shooting their first free throws. First trip to the line in this one. And he can't get the first one. One thing about the Lakers, Clark, over the last couple seasons, <laughs> they get themselves to the free throw line. Yeah, and a lot of that is due to the fact they've got some real creators in their lineup, guys who can attack off the dribble at multiple positions from multiple angles, and that creates pressure for the defense. He doesn't get the second one. Clark, we know the Bucks are a veteran team that has now leveraged their assets to try to win now. And the question is, Kevin, do they have enough? There's a point at which veteran becomes a nicer way or a euphemism for old, especially in today's NBA. That can be a problem for you. James, no good. You know, I think the effort on defense there has everything to do with why he missed that shot. Well done. It's stolen by Davis. Four on three break. And LeBron with the basket, the assist by James. LeBron's got his second bucket. And making it look easy, LeBron overwhelms the defense inside. James has gotten two of his three shots to go tonight. Trent outside. Back to Lillard. To the paint. The shot comes out. Great D that time from Davis. Lakers have gone two for four from the field so far today. James, the pass to James. From outside, off the mark. And so it's Trent with it. He brings it up for Milwaukee. Trailing by two. James against Lillard. Over James. And that one's good. Lillard. For a supreme score like Lillard. Those tough ones often go down. Outside, Davis. Pass to Hachimura. And that one falls coming off of Davis' speed. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Now oh, here's Young. Lopez kicks to Giannis. Lillard is screen on James. Giannis passes to Trent. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Los Angeles leading by three. That shot is off. And so it's Milwaukee now. Pass to Middleton. 
Lopez outside. There's a screen. Here is Lillard. Went it go with a three. Good on the three-point shot. Lillard's got seven. You just cannot permit Lillard to get into a zone from deep. I mean, once that happens, you can't turn the valve off. Now here's James. And a wide open look for Hachimura. Here's Davis. Good D by Lopez. Milwaukee's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Trent finds Lillard. Middleton looking it over. Shoots over Hachimura. And there are the Bucks with another bucket. Nice handles by Middleton. Actually, really impressive handle. Put on the show with that dribbling exhibition. And J.J. Reddick calls timeout here. He's ready to talk things through with the team. Bucks on defense. James outside. And he banks in the lane. He has six. That's as good as you can defend LeBron inside, and it's still not good enough. The Bucks have gone four of seven from the field, shooting over 50%. Lillard finds Trent. Giannis outside. Three-pointer. Hachimura grabs the miss. The Lakers shooting 40% here in the early stages. Loads it up for Davis. Stolen by Middleton. Now, Andekumbo hasn't made one yet. And Special K as good as Damian Lillard can be throughout a game. He definitely takes it up a notch in crunch time. Couldn't agree with you more, Kevin. He's one of those guys that certainly seems to rise to the occasion and relish in the clutch moments. And his range is in the gym like. I mean, 30 feet away, 35 feet away, he shoots it the same as if it's a mid range jumper. We throw good, Damian Miller. Hey, Lillard has all the talent in the world, but, man, this guy is a great leader. Lots of charisma, and he holds his teammates accountable. DeLon Wright, he's checked in for Milwaukee. The free throw is good from Lillard. And at the line, it's all about consistency with him. His routine, his stroke, it never wavers. James, the pass to Davis. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Well, there's no question, and he welcomes this, that Anthony Davis shoulders a heavy load on the defensive end. And he should, and he does. I mean, he's a true anchor. He protects the rim. He can guard out on the perimeter. He communicates well. He's got an Shoot excellent two. basketball IQ. And he's a guy that can cover up a lot of mistakes from his teammates. And the first one at the line is good. And, you know, for a big man, Anthony Davis has always been above average at the free throw line. Milwaukee making a switch here. Donatons checked in. And so he hits both. 
and Clark for the Lakers. Their last two seasons ended in playoff losses to the Denver Nuggets. And I tell you what, they fought hard both times, Kevin. The point differential was only 24 points over the four games in 2023 and just 11 points in 2024. L.A. actually led most of the five-game series but weren't able to advance. Torian Prince, he's checked in for Pat Connaughton. And so James will bring it up for Los Angeles. Outside, Davis. Pass to Hachimura. Krills the three-pointer. Hachimura's got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for Los Angeles. And we know Hachimura has a confident personality. You see it there with the rise and fire approach. Nice. Now here's Middleton. Here's Lillard beyond the arc. Hands it from downtown. Lillard's got 12 points in the game. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. So it's the Lakers now after Damian Lillard was able to get the three to go. Hachimura kicks to LeBron. LeBron to the Kumbo. And the shot no good, a bit short. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy like him that good a look. Here's Lopez. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. Just like clockwork, Lopez doing damage inside. The Lakers trail. Outside, James. James against Giannis. And here is Hatchimura. He's got six. Down to five on the shot clock. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. The defender gets caught in a bad position there. LeBron so powerful. Powerful enough to convert through contact. We passed year 20 for LeBron James. Uh, Clark, how is he still doing this? Well, I'd love to find out, but he's got a combination of remarkable DNA and obviously a tremendous work ethic and attention to detail and taking care of his body. But My some blade. of it is it's a My blend blade. of um, good shot. fortune and a lot of hard work. But he's played at a level at his age that I never thought I'd see in basketball. It's different in other sports, but to do what he's doing on the court is amazing. Free throw good, LeBron. And LeBron, the only player to reach 40,000 points in his career. Clark, you're shaking your head. It's incredible, isn't it? Absolutely remarkable, Kevin. And I did not think I would see it in my lifetime. 40,000 points. Just the sound of that is ridiculous. And, you know, he not only has lived up to the hype, that has followed him since he was 15 years old. He's actually exceeded it, Kevin, which is crazy. Vanderbilt's checked in for James. Here's Lillard. 12 points for him. Lopez outside. Pass to Prince. Here's Bochamp. He's looking for Lillard and finds him. Doesn't go that time. Los Angeles has gone two or four from beyond the arc to start the game. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Kevin, thank you very much. Anthony Davis broke his defense down for me. He said, I can block shots, switch on to anybody, guard the pick and roll. I can guard the post. I can guard the pin down. So that's my ability. My ability defensively is to do everything. Kevin? And he does everything. David, thank you so much. Now, here's Lopez. A rebound by the Lakers. Davis has got four rebounds now tonight. Now, here's James. He's tightly guarded. Alert against Hachimura. Oats it up for Davis. Lopez with the steal. To the inside. 
Prince the pass to Lopez. It's stolen by Davis. Reeves against Prince. Hachimura kicks to James. Frames the three-pointer. And early in his career, that's a great sign for Bronny. Hitting threes, building confidence in that jumper. Lillard with it. He's got 12. Mark, there are some that would say that Giannis Antetokounmpo is the best player in Milwaukee Bucks history. Others might say Lou Alcindor. What do you say? Hey, pump the brakes on that Giannis. I love the Greek freak. But I tell you, Kareem is my guy. I would tip my hat there, but I certainly understand why others would say Giannis. I'm going to hang my hat with Kareem. A free throw good from Lillard. So both teams changing it up here. He's perfect from the line this time. The Lakers in the lead. Here's Vincent. Pass to Davis. Back to Vincent. From outside the arc. Rebound by Smith. The Bucs have gone 6 and 12 in the field here in the first quarter. Here's Lillard over in the corner, Portis. And a little luck that time, but it drops. And it's all knotted up. This speaks to how assertive Portis is, and he's skilled at knocking it down off the catch, too. Lillard against Russell. Hits Davis on the wing over Smith. And Davis can't get it to go. Bucks have gone 7 of 13, just over 50% from the floor. Some good looks. And it's Smith missing. LA's gone 3 of 7 from three point range in the first quarter. Benson with it, working on Smith. And Davis gets it to go. This is why they feed Davis inside. I mean, they know how much of a beast he is down there, and he eats good. 137 left to play in the first quarter. Lillard outside. Back to Middleton from 18 feet away. A rebound by the Lakers. Now Vincent scoreless thus far. To the middle. The fader. And off the front iron, and in it goes. And now a four-point Los Angeles lead. 56 seconds left in the first. Lillard from deep three-point land. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got six rebounds here tonight. Christie the pass to Vincent. Russell feeling it out a bit. Pass to Wood. Takes the three. That shot off. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game. And Middleton kicks to Johnson. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. Middleton's got three assists in the game. Middleton, a scorer by nature. That time showing you he can find his teammates, too. 20 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Here's Vincent, covered by Johnson. Vincent with it. To the inside. It's stolen by Smith. One second left. That one misses. One quarter in the books, and it's been a close one so far. Lakers lead by one. After this break, we'll be back with the start of the second quarter on 2K Sports.
And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far on the scoreboard. And taking a look at Los Angeles' performance here, what have they been doing or not doing? Just a terrific first quarter, sparked really by their unselfishness. Yeah, and you know, so many of their hoops came off an assist, which is a good sign of ball movement and sharing that ball. And the Bucks with possession here. They trail by one. So with Lillard on the bench, here's the five for Doc Rivers right now. We've got Green. Chris Middleton is out there with Jackson. Then there's Bobby Portis. And it's right in at the one. Now here's Middleton. Portis sets the pick for Middleton. So they take the lead. Middleton's got the opening basket here in the second quarter for the Bucks. Great. What a great time to be a fan of basketball. Not just in the NBA, but all over the world. Absolutely, Kevin. The sport just continues to grow, and there's increased value being placed on all-around skill, even in youth basketball. And I think that bodes well for the future of the game. Here's LeBron following the basket by Chris Middleton. James, the bounce pass, just five on the clock. Here's Rush. It's rebounded by Portis. Milwaukee has gone three of seven tonight from three-point territory. Jackson kicks to right. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. And pushing it up. Here's Los Angeles. Connect with it. Now Green defending. And here's Green. He'll bring it up for the Bucks. They haven't allowed any points in the second quarter. Middleton outside. Portis sets the pick for Middleton. They get it back with one on the clock, and Jackson throws it down hard. Nothing soft about the putback there. And why chance it, right? Take the dunk if you've got it. Well, you know, if nobody's going to put a body on him, then that's going to be the result. Pass to Hood, Shafino. LeBron against Middleton. Over Middleton. Yep, it goes in, and the Milwaukee lead is cut down to just one on the basket from James. And production, one of the things James does best. He's so skilled at finding shots for himself. Now here's Middleton. Here's Green. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's going to be on Cam Reddish. For Milwaukee, they have shot 67% from the line tonight, going for a six. And he makes the first. Trent's checked in for Milwaukee. And both free throws good for Green. Lakers trail by three. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need the basket. We know what a great shooter Wood is, but I love it when Christian brings it down low and pounds that paint. Los Angeles shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. One falls for him. Really hard not to appreciate a steady big guy like Christian Wood. I mean, he knows his role out on the floor, doesn't try to do things he can't, and really gives it his complete effort and focus. I love that. The Bucks making a switch here. Livingston's checked in. The Lakers also making some changes. Connect, he's checked in for Lewis. Reddish comes in for Christie. And it's Gabe Vincent in for D'Angelo Russell. Milwaukee in the lead. 
Wright looking around. Outside Portis lets the three fly. And James pulls it down. Lakers have gone one of three to start out the second quarter. And the dunk by Wright. That's a stomach punch, guys. Mm. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. You know, those kinds of plays can be difference makers, game changers, momentum shifters, especially in a close contest where one or two possessions can impact the outcome. Here's LeBron after the basket by Milwaukee. Inside, here's Vincent. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. Vincent's got his first points of the game. Setting the table for his teammates, James. Enjoy sharing and passing the ball and getting others involved, I think, more than any other aspect of his game. And we've got a timeout called by Doc Rivers. Wants to talk some things over. Might be seeing some things to adjust. in for the Bucks. Damian Lillard comes in for right and Los Angeles will go for a different look here. Vanderbilt's checked in for Wood. Hachimura comes in for Connect. James checked in for Reddish. And it's Russell in for Vincent. Here's Middleton. Trent outside. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Portis the screen. For three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no cover. Here's Russell. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. And so it's Trent with it. He brings it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. Only giving up six here in this quarter. Here's Middleton. And it's good off the back of the rim and in. Middleton's got four points in the quarter. Well, I like the fact that Middleton takes advantage of the mid-range jump shot. When he gets room to pull the trigger from there, he's taking it, and he's almost automatic. Now, here's Vanderbilt. Still yet to score. Here's Russell. And Chris Middleton pulls it down. Milwaukee leading by three. Of all the great ball handlers, Clark, in the NBA, Russell's got to be right there at the top of the list. And the thing that impresses me, Kevin, is how smooth he makes it look and how effortless it appears. Even at full speed, he can make moves that most guys can't even imagine. Russell passes to James. Oh, LeBron's just too strong inside. Hey, I really like what I'm seeing from LeBron here tonight, keeping it simple. He's going to the hot hand, which is him. That's pretty good. Milwaukee has gone 0-3 from beyond the arc to start the second quarter. Here's Lillard. Vanderbilt with the rebound. Lakers have gone 3-7 of shooting the ball here in the second quarter. Here's Hachimura. Gets the 14-footer to fall. Hachimura's got eight. And a solid shooter from mid-range. Hachimura with textbook fundamentals. Portis is screen on Russell. Three-pointer Lillard. Offensive rebound. Portis. That one good for two. And the Bucks lead by one. Guys, what a tight start to the game this has been. And it's still in the first half. This could be a wild one. Pass to Russell. To the paint. Here's Vanderbilt. Count it good. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for Los Angeles. To me, it's been the ball movement. That's been the key. I mean, going from good to great. Not settling for a good shot, making that extra pass, keeping the defense off balance, and taking great shots. And they've also been feeling it from beyond the arc. Good start for them so far. Giannis Antetokounmpo's checked in for Torian Prince. The free throw off from Vanderbilt. The Bucs have gone 5 of 11 from the field since the beginning of the second quarter. Middleton dishes to Lillard. Trent outside. 
and he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. The Bucks have scored six points from their eight attempts at the line so far. And last season, 77% from the line. They could usually get the job done there. He misses the free throw. Los Angeles making a switch here. James is checked in. And he's good on the second. The Lakers shooting very well, 56% for the floor here in the second quarter. Reeves the pass to LeBron. From range, LeBron is good! Well, you know, defensively, you try to keep LeBron out of the lane, but then he drops that on you. Mm. And timeout, Doc timeout. Rivers has called a timeout. This will Sorry. give him a chance to discuss some potential alterations. Milwaukee making a switch here. Prince has checked in. James against Lillard. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. Pat Connington, he's checked in for Portis. Number 24, Pat Connington. James looking around. LeBron. James doing his thing in close to the hoop. Good work there. Bucks trail by five. Lost to Connaughton. Back to Lillard. Goes up the baseline. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. Davis has got seven rebounds in the game. Things really clicking for him at the offensive end. They're making good decisions, not wasting these opportunities. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. And here's Prince outside. That one's in his first bucket of the game. He's one for two. Yeah, you know, Prince is always doing a nice job working to get open. And that's the reward you get for staying active, keeping yourself moving. An open look on the jump shot there. And here is James after Torrey and Prince hitting the three. Reeves gets the bucket, and the Lakers lead by four. Seems to have a knack for hitting guys in their spots. His vision excellent. Prince setting a pick for Lillard. The three, and again Milwaukee with the triple. Some nights Lillard can just keep going and going. Prince against LeBron. The athleticism of LeBron James. This guy is a high flyer. I mean, especially for a power forward, and he needs to be as an undersized player. And here's Lillard. He brings it up for the Bucks. It's a three-point game. Prince with a screen on James. Lillard from outside. The rebound by James. LeBron's got four rebounds now tonight. Loads it up for Davis. And stolen by Prince. Now the Bucks moving it up. The setup and the slam by Giannis. And Adekumpo is so long. I mean, he stretches forever, covers a ton of ground. So it's the Lakers now. 
Reeves outside. Pass to Hachimura. Picks it out to James. The three. It's held in by Trent. Bucks have gone 8 of 16 from the field in the second quarter. A nice, efficient 50%. Back to Lillard. Gets up a three. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Lillard's got a couple of three-pointers in the second for the Bucks. You won't find too many players with a better understanding of the pick and roll than Lillard. He runs that set to a tee. Now here's Davis. He's got six. No one near Reeves as he lets it go. And that one falls coming off of Davis's feed. Reeves has got five. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. Prince shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Second personal. That one on Davis. You know, Torian Prince is not the guy you want to send to the foul line. For Milwaukee, they have shot 70% from the free throw line tonight. Seven for ten. That free throw missing. Well, I like the fact that Prince um, does a good job picking his spots. He's not a guy that forces things. Uh, kind of lets the game come to him naturally. Lopez, he's checked in for the Bucks, And the Lakers also making a switch. Vanderbilt's checked in for James. And the second free throw, good. L.A. has gotten a lot of looks from outside tonight. 5 of 12. Reeves the pass to Davis. Down low. Here's James. He can't get it to go. Milwaukee's gotten the three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. 6 of 15. And the basket by Lillard. Productive habits pay off for Lillard. He's always working on his offense to refine his skill. Now here's James. There's the triple. A rebound by the Bucks. And the Kumbo has got six rebounds here tonight. Trent outside. Onto Takumbo. Passes to Lillard. The Lakers with the rebound. Clark, what is it about Austin Reeves' style of play that makes him such a good scorer? I love the fact that he can change pace with the dribble. You know, he's not super fast, but he's not slow either. What he is is shifty and smart. He's got good size, good ball skills, and he's got a nice mid-range jumper. All of that allows him to keep defenders off balance. And the Bucks with possession here, following the bucket by the Lakers. And that one's good, Lillard. So effective in the catch and shoot is Lillard. You give him an inch, and he's taking much more than that. Pass to Vanderbilt. James kicks to Hachimura. Offline with his three. Milwaukee in the lead. Three-pointer Lillard. Vanderbilt with the rebound. James against Trent. To the paint and stolen by Lillard. Fast break, Milwaukee. Loads it up for Giannis. Can't complete the alley-oop. Los Angeles has gotten cold from deep in the second quarter. Just two of six from long range. Fires the three. Hachimura, no good. And for Milwaukee, they're shooting at 48% from the floor. Looking good. And Lillard kicks to Prince. Cast to Trent. Lopez, a screen on James. Trent gets the bucket. Trent's got the lead up to four now for the Bucks. Boy, Lopez hunkered down and anchored in on that pick. And he's going up for the alley-oop. And it's slammed in by Davis. 
And how about the incredible timing on that alley-oop? He absolutely hammered it down. Well, I tell you what, that's the play we'll remember if they can put together a little surge to break this game over. And so it's Damian Lillard making things happen for Milwaukee. He ends up dropping in two from distance, making a difference from long range in this one. And we'll be back with you shortly. We've got second half action for you, and if the next couple quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. We're seeing a tremendous game from Damian Lillard. Yeah, he's just been raining down on him from deep here. You talk about dialed in. Well, you know, the stroke looks fantastic. Even when he's had a hand in his face, it hasn't affected him at all. And so Lillard will bring it up for the Bucks. The lead is two, taking a look at the Lakers. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. James is out there with Austin Reed. And it's Hachimura in at the three spot. Here's Reeves. James outside. against Trent. Reeves the pass to James. James right side. That one drops for him. LeBron's got 22. From mid-range, LeBron really dialed in. Can't think you're safe giving him those shots. Lopez a screen on James. Middleton outside. Launches it. Hachimura grabs the miss. Hachimura's got his fifth rebound in this one. Davis setting the pick for Hachimura. A miss that time would have put him up. And you know, even though that shot didn't go down, I, I like how they got him a wide open look in space there. Middleton finds Lillard. Fires from deep. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. Davis has got eight rebounds in this game. The Lakers trail. In the corner, it's James. They get it again. And it's slammed in by Davis. Nice putback on that follow from Davis. Was just determined to get that rebound. Over a minute and a half into the third quarter of action. Lopez outside. There's the lob at Macumbo. And it's out of bounds. The Bucks able to retain possession here. Yeah, gets a finger on it, but just can't quite come up with the steal. Clearly a careless pass. He got away with one there. Lillard scanning the floor. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's on Bronny James. Yeah, you never want to foul Dame in the act. He's almost automatic from the line. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Both free throws good for Damian Lillard. 
Into the third we go. Two minutes in now. The Lakers have gone two of four here to start the second half. Davis with a screen on Giannis. Lopez with the steal. Middleton against Hachimura. Pass to Antetokounmpo. Pocket four. Lillard outside. Second shot opportunity. Misses off the left eye. Well, they'll be happy with that look, even though it didn't fall. You know what? That's a confidence shaker for him, though. I mean, that's a shot he expects to make every time. From deep LeBron. Drills it from outside. LeBron's got five points now this quarter. That defense has to worry so much about LeBron as a passer that it opens things up for his jump shots. Lillard finds Trent over James. Trent gets the bucket. Trent's got five. A great competitive game so far. And from the look of it, this one could go right down to the wire. Pass to LeBron. Back to James. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. Oh, nice body control there from James to get that shot off while taking the contact. Lakers shooting their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight. good on the free throw and what you love about Ronnie James is his defense first mindset whether he's at the point of attack or playing off the ball he's a disruptor good on the second free throw yeah Look, you'd like to take the lead on that possession, but he, at least he was able to tie the game up. Outside, out of the combo. Trent kicks to Middleton. And here's under the combo outside. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. James, the pass to James. Stolen away. Here's Trent, and there's a nice one-handed slam. That's a stomach punch, guys. Mm. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. You know, those kinds of plays can be difference makers, game changers, momentum shifters, especially in a close contest where one or two possessions can impact the outcome. And so it's Trent with it. He brings it up for Milwaukee. A two-point game. LeBron with some nice D. Los Angeles has gone one of four and three-point shots here in the third. Hachimura against Middleton. Now here's LeBron. He's covered closely. No good there. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. They double him with James. Trent with the wide-open look. Buries the long-range jumper. Trent's got the lead up to five now for the Bucks. Rick Lopez with every penny as he secured a nice raise last season. Yeah, you know, he's a combination of a three-point shooting big who's also an elite rim protector. That's a heck of a combination and a valuable one in today's game. have gone a somewhat so far 4 of 10 on their shots in the second half so far. Alert against James. 
Lillard outside. Lock at six. Trent, that's a two-pointer. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. Trent's got 12 points in the game. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. LeBron, shot is off. Here we go, one-on-one. -on -one. Trent gets the bucket, and it's a six-point Milwaukee lead. Every team looking to get easy ones in transition. I think one of the best ways, guys, to score in transition is that quick hitter after the first burst. Smart anchor at passes, Greg, are really paying off for them at the moment. And also good off-ball movement. Everyone is paying attention and looking to create the best shot for the team. LeBron up top, covered by Giannis. Greg, everything they're doing is working right now. Good run they have going right now. The momentum is huge. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for the Bucks. All game long, they've had active hands and really out in the passing lanes. And that aggression on defense has resulted in a ton of steal. Yeah, you know, the defense just hasn't been able to keep up with them in this one. The transition game as a result of good defense has been very strong. And J.J. Reddick calls timeout here. He wants to check in with his team and regroup. Right, he's checked in for Milwaukee. And the Lakers also making a switch. Russell's checked in. outside and stolen by Wright with the drive and finished off by Wright. This has always been a strength for Wright, attacking downhill off the dribble. Here's James. He's got six. Pass to Davis. And they double up Davis. Down to five on the shot clock. And here's James outside. And he's good on the three ball. LeBron's got eight here in the quarter. Just reliable, guys. He's just always trying to make the right play. Lillard, the vast Giannis. Bucks passing it around. Wright sets a screen for Anadokounmpo. Floats one. And Wright gets it to go on the assist by Giannis. Wright's got six. And out of the Kumpo is a nightmare in the pick and roll. Burns you with the scoring and passing ability. Davis with a screen on Lillard. Bounce pass Russell. And finished off by Davis. Doing all he can so far, but they still find themselves trailing. Now, here's Lillard. He's got 26. down to Middleton. It's right on the wing. Giannis sets a screen for right, and there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. And guys, point of emphasis for the league is to really crack down on illegal screens. Yeah, you know, he might have gotten away with that a few years ago, but not anymore. No way. Now you've got to be stationary on those screens. No extra hips or elbows, or they'll call it. Los Angeles making a switch here. Vincent's checked in. Here's Hachimura. Again, Los Angeles. <laughs> you don't see that too often, the fadeaway shot when he's wide open. Now, well, Greg, it took 40 years, but the Bucs finally won their second NBA title back in 2021. Yeah, Kareem leading that 71 squad. Giannis was the man in 2021, averaging 35 and 13 during the finals. Closing out the Suns with that 50-piece in Game 6. Hachimura finds Davis. Over in the corner, Vincent. Off target from three-point range. You know, he's not a knockdown shooter from there, but when you're that uncovered, 
you almost are forced to take it. Alert against Hachimur. Here's Lopez. Great tee that time from Davis. Lakers trail by five. And here is Hachimura. He's got ten. And a wide open look for James. Nailed from three-point land. LeBron's got 11 in the second half. Milwaukee has gone into a slump here from three point range. Time out, time out. Shooting just one to five here in the third. And Doc Rivers has called a timeout. And Coach has decided they need a moment to talk things over. Some changes here for the Bucks. Both champs checked in. And it's Pat Connington in for Lillard. The Lakers also making some changes. Hayes is checked in for LeBron. Lewis comes in for Rui Hachimura. Christie subbed in for James. Antetokounmpo passes to Bochamp. And Middleton now atop the key. on the shot and picks up two points so one free throw coming up oh, I tell you what Middleton really does a nice job at being able to score through contact sometimes he gets hammered and he still gets it up and down and he'll be shooting his first free throw of the game here and last season's numbers show him at about an 83% clip which is far better than most yeah you know that was one spot where they didn't have to worry about him at all I mean at the free throw line he was automatic one shot Here's Vincent. Pass to Davis. Second chance effort. Rebounded by the Bucks. Giannis has got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. The kick out to right. And here's Middleton. Now, Connaughton. Nothing on the board. Just three to shoot. Fires from 14. Lakers with the rebound. There's a minute 47 left to play in the third. Benson with it. Hits Davis on the wing. And they double up Davis. Back to Vincent. Davis with a screen on right. Vincent misses. Bucks leading by five. And it's in up top. Defended by Christie. Right, the pass to Beauchamp. Pulls up from the corner. Shots good by Middleton. Middleton's got 11 points. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting 47% from the field in the third. Davis finds Vincent. outside sinks the triple Lewis has got his first three points of the game defensively there was a lack of aggressiveness and it really made it easy for him to knock that shot down there's 47 seconds left in the third now here's Middleton covered by Hayes from deep and it's Chris Middleton with the three he's got 14 clapping back at him Middleton says, I can do that too. Pass to Davis. Count the basket and the foul. It goes on Giannis Antetokounmpo. How about battling through the impact there and then wheeling that basketball in? Boy, it does your heart good to see that kind of determination in a play. Really excellent focus that time.
just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Lewis against Middleton. Six to shoot. Smith sets the pick for Middleton. Fires the three. He doesn't hit that one. And we've reached the end of the third. Milwaukee on top, up by four. And we'll get going after this from Milwaukee. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? Yeah, a terrific, unselfish play right here. Set up his teammate, and how about the setup this one? Yeah, and as a two-guard, he's typically not a reluctant shooter, so it was really nice to see him orchestrating for a teammate instead. And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. The guard and off guard are Lillard and Trent. Then there's Bobby Portis. And there's Jackson, and it's Livingston in at the four spot. That's the group for Milwaukee right now. James, and contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Look, the physicality has always stood out with LeBron. It's been obvious, but his basketball IQ is what makes him such a special, special player. I mean, he sees the game like very few ever have. That one misses. And he's good on the second. And so it's Trent with it. He brings it up for the Bucks. They've led by as much as 10. Port is a screen on Christie. And the three ball is good. Trent's got 14 points here in the second half. Man, he's got a lot of firepower right now. I mean, what a half he's had. Wood sets a screen. Let's it go from deep. And it's out of bounds. They say it was the last touch by Jackson. Coming down to the floor for the Lakers. Connect. D'Angelo Russell. To the left side wing. Here's Christie. Ron right side. Pass to connect. Yes. And it's James picking up the assist. LeBron's got four assists now tonight. You have to stay attached to connect. He's a terrific off-ball threat. A little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone right now. Russell against Willard. Now here's Jackson. Outside Portis. To come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. Here's James. About a minute and a half through the fourth quarter now. Corner shot. Damian Lillard pulls it in. Milwaukee leading by three. Beyond the arc. Hits it from three point range. Lillard's got 29. And no doubt about it, Lillard is an effective half-court player, but he's also lethal in transition. Russell sets a screen for LeBron. For three, Milwaukee with the rebound. Portis has got five rebounds tonight. Three-pointer, Lillard. No good that time. Lakers trail by six. Russell kicks to LeBron. On the stripe, carries the jump shot. 
James. LeBron's got 34. And that's right in his wheelhouse, looking to make an impact when it counts. You know, they want the ball in his hands here because they trust him to hit all the big shots. Lillard outside. Trent against Christian. Trent can't hit. Well, you know, this is what happens. You can't afford to lose concentration even for a nanosecond. Connect. No good. And I thought that was going to drive. It looked good from here. Trent outside. Traps in the tray. 20 points for him. And that's just cold blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Guys, when you're this hot, it's elementary. Let it fly. Keep staying at it. Wood with the screen for James. Shoots over Lillard. That's it, and the Milwaukee lead is cut to just five on the basket from James. Superb work in the pick and roll that time by LeBron James. Such a pro at executing in these sets. Takes advantage of whatever mistake the defense makes. Livingston, no luck. L.A.'s gotten just one of four three-pointers to go down for them here in the fourth. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. To the inside, Portis. And Portis throws it down. The slam from Portis. Impressive. Using that size around the rack. Lakers trail by seven. Outside, Russell. LeBron outside. To the middle. Trying to find Wood. Gets it to him. Misses from short range. Bucks have gone four of eight in this fourth quarter, shooting at even 50% from the field. And it's Lillard missing. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. Russell with a wide open look. And again, the Lakers no good. Boy, I'm absolutely shocked he didn't get that one to go. Usually he's money from deep. Lillard the pass to Trent. Portis is screen on Christie. Back to Lillard from outside the arc. Carries it from three-point range. Lillard's got the lead up to 10 now for the Bucks. And the shot first mindset of Lillard. When he sees an opening in the defense, he's looking to attack. Wood up top. Out to Russell. Wood is screen on Lillard. Six on the shot clock. Three-pointer. Wood can't hit. And I like the bold move of going right back at him to return the three, but he just couldn't get it to go. It's Trent on the wing. Wood with the block. Boy, what a denial by Wood. He relishes the chance to throw it out of there. <laughs> Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. As a junior college product, Dalton Connect Gray didn't have a traditional path to the NBA. Yeah, Kevin spent two years at a JC, two more at a small Division I program, then used his extra year of eligibility to transfer to Tennessee, and there he became a first-team All-American and turned himself into a first-round pick. And the first one at the line is good. Well, Connect started his NBA journey at a community college, grew three inches while he was there, eventually transferred to a major program and turned himself into a first-round pick. A new lineup here for the Bucks. The Lakers also making some changes. Davis has checked in for Christian Wood. Hachimura comes in for Christie. And Gene subbed in for Russell. Both good from the line that time. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for Milwaukee. Pass to Connaughton. There it goes out of the Kumbo. Knocks it down from seven feet. And the Bucks lead by ten. It's almost illegal. Somebody as big as Giannis shouldn't really have that quick of a first step. And here is Hatchimer. James, the pass to Davis.
Shot clock at five. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. And the dunk by Hachimura. And proving to be effective around the rim. Hachimura leaving no doubt about that one. Bucks leading by eight. Middleton dishes to Lopez. Middleton outside. Now here's Connaughton. Not a lot of room. Six to shoot. And a miss there on the triple. Lakers trail by eight. Here's Connect. Here's James. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It goes on Giannis Antetokounmpo. Bully ball for LeBron has been doing that since he stepped into the league. No good on that. A different look for Milwaukee. Trent comes in for Ben Connaughton. And Damian Lillard subbed in for Johnson. Austin Reeves is checked in for the Lakers. So he comes up empty, missing both. Milwaukee leading by eight. James against Lillard. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got 15 rebounds here tonight. Took him no time at all on that one. So it's the Bucks now. Now here's Lillard. Giannis outside. Lopez sets a screen for Giannis. Milwaukee, no good that time either. That's one he knows he should have drained. Hachimura down low. Defended by Trent. From deep, Reeves. Good on the triple. Now it's just a three-point Milwaukee lead. And the instincts there from Hachimura. Notice the overcommitment by the defense and then makes the right pass. And Middleton kicks to Lillard. Over James. And there's Lillard. That's good on the assist by Middleton. Middleton's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Lakers trail by five. And here is LeBron. This one for three. Damian Lillard grabs the loose ball. Side out of the Kumbo. Off target with his three. Lakers shooting 48% from the field. Not bad at all. James looking it over. Back to Davis. Shoots the three. It's held in by Trent. Trent's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Pass to Lillard. Inside. Big time! And slam Giannis! Oh, my! Once Giannis gets that close to the rim, you know that he'll do everything he can to make the finish happen. LeBron against Antetokounmpo. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. It goes on Giannis Antetokounmpo. First one drops. Oh, 
Both shots good from the strike. And it seems like he's regaining his focus. The form at the line tonight has not been as good for the most part. Lopez sets a screen for Middleton. Five to shoot. Fires for three. He hits hauled in by Los Angeles. You know, brick after brick after brick. I mean, that's been the story for him this quarter. I mean, he's got to brain it in down the stretch here. And he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. And to the Kumbo. And so he's picked up his final thumb. And he will sit for the rest of this game. Yeah, and, and luckily they, they've got terrific depth at that position. If there's one spot on the floor where they can afford to lose somebody, that would probably be it. First free throw is good. And so he's able to get one of two. That one miss was huge. He had a chance to turn this into a one-possession game. And that one is good. Trent's got 22 points. Smart pass by Porter, showing the ability to make good decisions with the ball. Lakers trail by six. Now James. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. Heads on Bobby Portis. LeBron delivering in the key moments. Huge basket from the King. Drops for James. And you really can't say enough about his composure in the big moments, as cool as they come. Middles in the pass to Lopez. Portis for three. Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got his 18th rebound here tonight, all over the place. Hachimura finds Davis. Lopez against LeBron. It up for Davis and finished off by Davis. Poise under pressure to produce at the right time in the big time. A deep. Milwaukee in the lead. Lillard outside. Pass to Trent. Stolen by Reeves to take the lead. And he sinks the layup. Time running low, guys, and uh, somebody has got to win this one. Yeah, well, who knows? We might need overtime in this one. It's been that kind of a game. And here's Lillard. He brings it up to the Bucks. From down in the low post, it goes. Lillard's got 10 points now just in this quarter. His team is in a tight spot, but Lillard keeps his cool, totally focused on getting them what they need. The Lakers shooting uh, about 47% here in the fourth. Outside for Davis. Wide open look. And the rebound goes to Lopez. The Bucks shooting about 45% from the four in the fourth. Over to the left wing. Somebody's really lit the fuse for Damian Lillard. So it's the Lakers now, trailing by four. James against Portis. Shoots over Portis. It's good! 
and he has brought them to within two points. Boy, they're having major trouble dealing with LeBron. They'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see longer possessions from this point on. Here's Trent. It counts. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. Well, that was one, two. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. And J.J. Reddick is called timeout. This is a huge moment, folks, in this game. And he wants to be prepared. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Hey, guys, J.J. Reddick's message with his team was simple. The message was simple. Keep fighting. Coach told his team, we're in this. We just need some extra effort. Let's go. We'll see if they can come back. Kevin? Thank you, David. Los Angeles now. Reeves the pass to James. Portis against LeBron. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Hey, every defender wants to deny LeBron, but if you fall for the pump fake, all you'll do is commit a foul. Cannot get the first one to drop. Tough one to miss. And the second of two is good. That narrows the lead down to just three. Hey, by missing that free throw now, a three could even the score. And an intentional foul right there. Okay. Third point the foul. There's 25 seconds left to play in the final quarter. And he commits the intentional foul. Gives them a four point cushion. And the second free throw, no good. A tough break there. Timeout called the Lakers. They're trailing by four. What do you think, Coach? His focus is going to be here. They're yeah, trying to get back in this thing. They need a score. Yeah, and they need it hiccup fast. I mean, they'll be drawing up a quick hitter in the huddle here, no doubt. the Lakers now. Four-point game. But Trey gets rebounded by Portis. You know, another 10-cut moment here because he continues to miss shot after shot from three-point range. This is not a fourth quarter he's going to want to remember. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good, and that puts them up by five. And so he drops them both. It's a six-point ball game. That to do it. I think any chance for a miracle comeback just went out the window with those three. And so they choose to intentionally foul. You have to foul, but I'm sure they would have liked to foul someone different. They didn't really have a, another option. I mean, I thought they did a nice job getting it in his hands and making sure he was the guy who'd go to the line. 
shooting two. So the first one drops, and that makes it a seven-point lead. Good. We both at the line, and it's an eight point game. Sinks the three pointer. And so the Bucks take the win. It was up for grabs right until the final seconds. Yeah, and, and for me, Kevin, what stood out is just the, the overall trust this group has in one another when it matters most. Doing what had to be done and to send these fans home happy. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and David Ohm, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. And now we present the player of the game. Damian Lillard.